welcome to vlogmas day 20 i've just got out of the shower and dried my hair so we've got fuzzy hair and a bit of mascara running down my face which is amazing and this light doesn't want to work either which is great um i'm literally just uploading yesterday's vlog so that i can quickly go and have that uploaded before i go and catch my train home so yeah today should be fun so I've just got back from the train and stuff and I've just chilled and had a cup of tea um, and got dressed into something that I didn't wear yesterday. So yeah, um, today I've pretty much got to sit and edit those photos and do some other like picture things for people. Um, yeah, also going to visit my great nan again and my Nan will be there as well. So going to do that, that'll be really nice. Don't know obviously how much I can film as I've said before because I don't normally take my camera to places like that because there's other people there and so they I don't know how like funny they are about it and like if other people don't want to be filmed and stuff like that. But I'll take my phone and I'll try and get some footage. But yeah, should be good. I think I might just go and have some early lunch. So I only just got back from going to my nan's and it's about four o'clock and I'm really craving snacks. So I'm walking all the way to the shop now to get some snacky stuff to eat in bed whilst watching one born. So yeah. <laughs> that is bright so the last time we spoke come on light work with me last time we spoke i was walking to the shops and i didn't film pretty much anything when i was out but that was just because it's like so busy when my nan is living my great nan is living and i had family there that i hadn't seen in ages and you have all the other families for all the other people there so it's not like you can just get out your camera and we were just having general conversation so it's not like it would have been any interesting at all um went to the shop got some food i've just felt really like hungry all the time today like to the point where i'm literally eating constantly <laughs> and i'm still starving so yeah so i've just been lying in bed watching an episode of one born every minute um I'm going to combine today's vlog with tomorrow's vlog because today I obviously haven't filmed an awful lot. I need to go in the bath and scrub off my tan from the weekend and like, come on like, <laughs> and get ready for our trip to Edinburgh. We're flying um, really early Friday morning so tomorrow I'm only going to be able to film like up until like afternoonish time because we'll have to edit the vlog, this vlog, and get it out there because I'm not taking my laptop to Harry's and I'm not taking my laptop on the holiday. We're just going to make it into one big vlog um, because we're only there for two days. There's no point me taking my laptop with me and be sitting there and editing and worrying about exporting everything when I'm on my holiday. So I'm going to make today and in the morning into a mixed vlog which you are watching now but yeah i need to do a bit of a pamper so i'll show you my pamper routine um but yeah oh it seriously felt so nice to just lie in bed i know that sounds stupid but like the last couple of days i've been trying to just like ram in everything to make sure that everything's ready for christmas and I've had loads of photo shoots and filming and stuff like that. So I haven't had the chance to just like lie down and just relax. Like every time I've gone to bed, I've gone to bed really late and then had to wake up really early. So it's nice to just relax and because I get a really bad back anyway. Pregnancy has pretty much like doubled that and it's just not really been the 
best for me to not be able to just like have a lie down or a rest or whatever so yeah I'm gonna just rest for a bit and then I'm gonna go in the bath and pamper and stuff and I'm actually really excited about that and then tomorrow I've got a pack great I don't know what to pack because nothing fits me and even if it is even if it does fit me it's not nice clothing and if it's maternity it's uncomfortable <laughs> so finding nice outfits for a weekend away is gonna be really difficult <laughs> makes you look absolutely gorgeous <laughs> so normally the first thing that I would do when I first get out of the bath is put on body butter um, mainly because since I got pregnant I have like really like dry skin like extremely dry skin and it makes all my skin really itchy and that so I find that the body shop's body butter is like the perfect like intense moisturizer for my whole body without making it feel like i've got like a, a bunch of cream just sitting on my skin or absorbing and making me feel oily and stuff but because i am fake tanning tonight there's no point in moisturizing my body to fake tan over the top because the moisturizer would act as like a barrier so i will have to moisturize in the morning when i've washed out my tan um so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put on a face mask because my skin really needs it. And I'm going to use my favourite L'Oreal Paris Pure Clay Glow Mask. And it's just the red one. So yeah, I'm going to pop this one on. The best thing about this clay mask is that it proper hydrates your skin it exfoliates so it gets rid of all the dead skin and the crap but also like proper hydrates your skin so it helps it like backs under the eyes so i'm gonna go ahead and put this on <laughs> was dragged away from my beauty routine to help my mum do these for school so yay <laughs> to do my eyebrows near Harry in the background and yeah I've done it really messy just because I want to get all the little hairs that are like white and that will be like that but basically all my skin will die but tomorrow it'll be gone well tomorrow night it'll be gone so that's fine so I have just fake tanned and took my eyebrow stuff off and I'm gonna go to bed and sleep I'll catch up with you in the morning Good morning everyone, so today, what's the time, it's like quarter to nine in the morning, I've been awake since about seven, which is great because today was like the first day in about a week or two weeks so I could have a lie in and I didn't but I slept really well so it's fine. Um, today is going to be me pretty much just packing and editing photos from a photo shoot that I did um, 
But yeah, packing should be weird because this is the first time I'm ever having to pack as a pregnant person. I'm having to pack like all the stuff that like I would need to take with me because I'm pregnant. Do you know what I mean? Um, yeah, it should be interesting. I've got... I think the only thing that's really going to be a struggle for me is outfits. Because as I have said a thousand times, maternity outfits are ugly, they're uncomfortable. And obviously I want to be comfortable, but I also want to like have nice outfits. Because like, this is the first time me and Harry have ever gone away. And we're going to nice places and we've booked restaurants and stuff. So I want to like be able to dress up nice and not wear nice outfits and stuff. So, let's put it there. So, yeah, it's going to be a bit of a difficult one. Packing the outfits. Because, like, I planned all my outfits around, like, these maternity jeans. I have these black, like, skinny maternity jeans. And then yesterday I wore them and I was literally, like, I'd take two steps and have to pull them up. So I don't really think they're going to be ideal for us walking around the city and exploring. So I've just made myself a cup of tea. I'm going to go back to bed for a bit and just chill and watch one one every minute as I always do and probably catch up on a bit of YouTube and I will catch up with you in a second. So I've just been in the shower. You can't help because I'm not washing my hair. It is greasy but there's no point me washing my hair now because then this flash gonna do me I did in it oh my god just stop because um we need to get up really early in the morning to go and get my flight so we will be sorry I'm talking like this I get so out of breath all the time now because of pregnancy um whew. So I'm going to wash my hair when I get to Harry's tonight so that it's like fresh and everything for the flight and for like the whole of tomorrow. Um, so that is my plan. So yeah, I've just got to stick with greasy hair for today but I'm only saying it and packing so it's not much of a problem. Um, but yeah, and now I'm, I've just washed off on my tan. Um, I just need to moisturise my entire body now which is great. I have just finished packing my suitcase um, as you can see my eyebrows are looking a little like brushed and shapely I waxed them this morning I was gonna film it but my camera died so I needed to like charge it but then I also really needed to do this at the same time um, I just waxed them myself <laughs> with those little wax strips that you can get and they've come out really well but I've they look a bit oily but that's because I completely just covered them in moisturiser because I could feel my eyebrows throbbing afterwards so I was like I better moisturise them um I've packed everything except for the stuff that's at Harry's um because I did go shopping the other day and get like little bits and bobs and a jumper to wear and they are all at Harry's, so I need to just pack those. But there is so much room in my suitcase, there's like loads. So I'll be able to get it all in. Um, I think I'm going to end this vlog here. Purely because I'm going out in an hour. So I need to have edited this. And then I need enough time to export it and to upload it before I go to Harry's at 5 o'clock. And it's like 2 now. So... Yeah, I'm going to finish this vlog here. I'm sorry if it was a bit of a crap one or a short one or whatever. I don't know how it's going to end up. Um, but the next vlog will be an Edinburgh one, which I'm really excited about. Yay. Um, so, 
I hope to see you in my next vlog. If I don't, have a really great Christmas. Love you all.